on board your board. Let's get this over with. <laughs> well, look who's here. New recruits? Well, <laughs> let's fuck some shit up. Uh, Al, do you really think this is a good idea? Well, of course. Uh, believe me after you know who's a fiasco. <laughs> Whatever. I'm sure people would love to see your new tent. And though, yes, he seems to be very new, according to social media. Wait, you? Oh, of course not. But... Angel was more than happy to share the information. You're welcome. Either way, I'm sure we all love to hear about this new up and comer, as well as his powers and what he did to Val. <laughs> I still can't believe he did such a thing to someone so important. I I was very sorry about that. I tried apologizing. He just wanted me to leave. Of course you apologized. Still weird that a demon would even think about saying sorry. Uh, right. I'm just this whole demon thing. Yes. Anyway, I think it'll be a great opportunity to show the positive side of your new endeavor. And how am I sure that this Izuku won't? I believe he'll behave. Yes, I, I don't plan on getting any fights or anything like that. Ever. And if I do, it's going to be self-defense, at least. See? Mm -hmm. What do you think, Baggy? I don't trust him. That's fair. What? I mean, heck, I'm a new person. You never met me before. I just appeared out of nowhere, wanting a place to stay just because Cherry Bomb... It keeps me from having a good night's sleep, and I I have never tried it. SSC before, and I did not know that was going to happen. And I ended up hurting people by accident, all because... Of... <sighs> to be honest, I'm very embarrassed about the whole ordeal. Um. Uh, okay... Baggy. Uh, what? Apologize. I didn't say anything wrong. I just don't trust him. You don't trust any guy. She doesn't? Well, no. Huh. Well, um, I... Hmm. I don't know what to really say about that, but, but I'm sorry. Wow, you apologize a lot. Maggie, uh, what he does is get on my nerves. I'm sorry. There you go again. Stop saying sorry. <sighs> Seriously, if only Angel does was this apologetic, at least half. Maybe he won't be such a pain in my ass. What? Uh, what are you talking about? Nothing. Just get ready. What? Oh yeah, we're keeping an eye on you. Not only is she going to announce that you're staying at the hotel, we're going to have uh, you make an appearance. Sure, your fans will be super surprised that you actually decided to go clean as soon as you get here. Just remember the reason why you're doing this uh, to be redeemed and hopefully go to heaven. Correct. 
and but no, that still seemed like an impossibility. Still. <sighs> All right. So when are we doing this? Today. What? I've only been here for like two weeks. Yeah. And Angel Dust ruined his. Uh, I mean her two week thing. So uh, seriously, you guys really don't like Angel Dust. You keep mistaking her for a guy. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I I hate her for other reasons too, but still. <sighs> okay. So, what so what do I really do is just <sighs> Is this boring you? No, 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 no. It's just when I woke up, it was a little early. I'm, I'm just used to hearing a bunch of explosions and kind of overslept a little. I'm still trying to get the sleep out of my eyes, you know. Whatever. Now, if you don't mind, let us begin with this. As soon as they arrive at the news station, yeah, Miss Killjoy is shocked to see that, yeah, Charlie's back. But also surprising, it's you again. Uh, well, um, hello, Miss Killjoy. Wait, you two know each other? She was on the strip. Uh, <clears throat> hmm. You might be able to do that to your advantage, John. But I don't want to blackmail. Was I? Come on, you sometimes do some good. You gotta be the bad guy. Uh, but that's my whole thing. I'm trying to be the nice person. The uh, voice of reason. I know, but sometimes, you know... Okay, let's get this over with. Let's get this train wreck finished so I can get on with the rest of my life. As, yeah, Izuku is crazy nervous when it comes to the cameras being all over him. He's like, yeah, this is a lot different from doing interviews when it comes to hero work. Okay, so why do you even want to try to be redeemed? You're a demon. You're already in hell, so what's the use? There's no real changing what's been done. It's not really for the fact that I want to be redeemed. It's just that I want life to be better. Feel it like this. It's not really, uh, people are subject to their environment, they're products of it. If you want things to be better, you gotta try and make the, at least the community better, and you should start with yourself, shouldn't you? Yeah, but what about the people who don't want to change? Well, then their lives are, may just as well continue sucking. Uh, hmm. Clever boy. Well, if anything, what what is it like living at the has been happy has been hotel? Well, it's nice. We have plenty of rooms, of course, as well as you know some interesting staff and residents. Huh? As he looks over at Tom and he's like, why do you look so scared? When she announced that you were going to be here, I I was shocked. And, um, what? As he smells something burning, he's like, he looks down and he's like, 
what happened to you? Him just just ringing towards you know who it was like oh hmm uh, Thema you are quite the woman aren't you Miss Killjoy <laughs> well you know I don't mean to brag but yes yes I am yeah I guess so Izuku he's just well, if anything, I think this could work. If even if we don't get to go back to heaven, making lives better for everyone else, maybe even trying to protect each other when it comes to the extermination, which we still have plenty of time to prepare for. We know when it's gonna happen. We could just prepare it a lot, you know, ahead of time beforehand. You know, really, what? That's not gonna work. We have angelic weapons, and I'm pretty sure you can find your some. You can get your hands on some pretty easily. Uh, <clears throat> well, yeah. I guess you have a point. Even if we don't fight back, we can at least protect ourselves. Their goal was to kill as many demons as possible, correct? And it's also... Wait, there's also something I didn't really understand. How come no, you know, earthborn demons are allowed to really take up residence in the other rings? What? Yeah, why are they all here? I. That's a good point, but. I mean, we. You are able to. Travel to the other. The rings, at least, aren't you? Or is just the. Pride ring the only one. You actually have access to? Uh. Huh. Actually, we never really thought of it like that. Because you gotta reconsider, like, are you magically binded to this this ring, or are you actually able to go to the other ones, or just don't want to? See, that there's a lot of variables that you may not be considering. Uh, huh. This just in, um, uh... Angel does this fucking shit up. Hey, hey, wait, we're not done with our little things. Are you trying to interrupt me, little fuckboy? Wait, what? Here, have some coffee. Oh, um... Thanks? As Charlie, she say, wait, why is she suddenly be so nice after calling him such a mean name? As soon as Izuku takes a sip of it, he's just like, Oh, that feels... Wait, what's... Yeah, we heard from an anonymous source that you, uh... Particularly like ecstasy. And then it begins again. This time, Charlie is beyond pissed here. But before she can go after Killjoy, Izuku just... No, 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 no. This bitch mine. There's, did, the fuck you call me is... She tries to attack Izuku. Him sewing Black Whip, tearing her down, and... Honestly, smacking her in front of everyone. Tom Trench, he's like... I wish my date was bad guy. This, 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 this ain't a bad show. As everyone is watching Izuku discipline this woman who has been nothing but a complete bitch to anyone she didn't like. Charlie, she wants to stop him, but she's like, you are my best friend ever. Baggy upon seeing like how he, yeah, he honestly took up for Charlie and how he is nowhere near as 
depraved or anything like everyone else she's met in hell, or possibly even her life in general. She's saying, okay, he's, he's alright, he's, eh, at the very least, he seems like not a complete asshole. At least, he's being nice to Charlie, sticking up for her, at least I don't have to worry about that nearly as much. Her trying to give him a sliver of niceness under her breath. Is, yeah, no no one's cut, telling them to cut the feet or anything. They're just watching this. But then it gets weird when Lady Killjoy is pretty much. They know it's something off. That she's actually starting to enjoy it. Charlie's getting freaked out by this. Is you can stop now? Is Charlie? He's just trying to. Yeah, she's trying to pry Black Whip tendrils all of her, but it's not working. Izuku was saying, "No, I want her to say it. Thank you." I want her to apologize to you. As she is saying never, up, right upon she's so close. He's you can tell. And then he stops. Her's like, wait, wait, what, what, what are you doing? <laughs> you haven't apologized. I'm not gonna let you finish until you apologize to her. Is it, what? There's no fucking way. All right then, I guess I, we're done here. As on air, from everyone who's watching, she has to apologize and begs you to continue the actions. As she looks at Charlie with the utmost respectful slash trustful and desperation-esque face and apologizes. Do, do you forgive her? Cause I won't. Because I'll keep teasing her into not letting her reach her full uh, climax until you forgive her. Like, hmm. And upon this, is like, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. Please, please, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean anything by it. Is, yep, I forgive her. Is the mess created from her reaching enlightenment? I'll say. Yeah, that that is when they finally decided to cut the feed. Like, go break. Please, that, that's enough. It's just like that. Gildre wasn't the only one interested in Zuku's actions. But upon him finally coming down from the euphoria, he's. I. Um. Him look at Charlie. He sees that she's happy. She's smiling back. He's pretty much giving him a thumbs up with a blank expression. Wait, you're not mad? No, of course not. I mean, you could have handled that better, but no, I'm not mad. Just thank you. I. Hmm. If anything, you've helped me. Boys, you've been trying to encourage me more than certain people. Listen. Don't let anyone tell you you can't do something. You never know unless you try. Thank you. <sighs> But seriously, I, 
Baggy might be right on one thing. We might need to kick out Angel. What? What for? He. I, I mean, she's being a little bit too much for the hotel's image to be anything but positive. I mean, you're you're great. You're showing that you want it. At least change, but Angel. <laughs> hmm? What's wrong, Angie? Uh, nothing. Uh, someone must be talking about me.